that Tiana wasn't going to play. How did that uh, change, if at all, did it change your mindset? Um, not really changed it uh, because, as Coach Q said, I did that all last year. But I just had to find ways to play smart, and I knew that I needed to be on the floor. And um, in order to stay on the floor, I had to play a little smarter. So uh, that was something that kind of changed for me. Um, but everything else was pretty much the same. Thanks, Mark. We're going to move on to Thomas Schultz. Hey, Kiki. Kind of off of that last question, what's it like coming into a game where you're kind of at the top of the key and working from there instead of maybe on the wing or having to run on curls? How does that change maybe your game gameplay strategy? Uh, it is a little more difficult uh, just because the defense is all looking at you at the top of the key, but um, that's when your mid-range have to come into play and got to be able to knock down outside shots. And um, I think I missed like my first four shots, uh, but I was able to get into some type of groove and um, I knew they would like, they like to take charges. So uh, I had to just play off two feet at the rim. All right, next question. We're going to go to Brandon Ross. Sorry, my mute button was not being friendly. Uh, Kiara, this is back-to-back -back 20 points games for you. Uh, did you just see holes for the defense last time and this time, or did something else feel like it was going well for you? Um, I just took what the defense gave me, and I, I just took my time. Um, I thought if I got my teammates involved, uh, it would open up some things for me, and that's what I did. I tried to get everybody involved before um, – taking taking some shots and like I said I missed my four first four shots so that's when I really knew I had to get my teammates involved first just so I can settle down and get into some type of groove. Thank you. The next question we're gonna go to is WKTV. I'm sorry I can't see who that is. Sorry it's Spencer Davidson I meant to change the uh the name. That's okay. My bad. Spencer, um, Kiara congrats on the win. Um Thank you. You know, obviously kind of just a play off of, you know, Tiana being out of the game, just how important, you know, uh, of a team win was this to have other players like Amaya, like Priscilla kind of step up and and be able to fill roles in a game where you're missing Tiana? Uh, it was very important. That's that's what it comes down to. It, it comes down to the to the younger ones and Amaya coming off the bench and um, they, they stepped up and and filled the role that they needed to play and um, coming off a tough loss on Sunday. Uh, I think this is a great team win for us. Thanks, Spencer. Next, we're going to go to Mike Curtis. Hey, Kira, congrats on the win. Thank you. Um, what do you tell your freshmen after, after a win like this where um, they kind of struggled, especially um, Camilla Cardoso? And what do you think they can learn from this experience? Um, just tell them to uh, just take their time and and just be patient. Um, things are gonna come to them and um, we're able to survive in advance. So they have another opportunity to, to showcase their talent and just let the game come to them and have fun. Appreciate it. Next question. We have time for two more for Kiki today. We're gonna go to Roshan Fernandez. Um, hi Kiki. I'm curious how you chose your moments, um, when to sort of play quickly, um, when to slow the game down, um, wait for the shot clock to tick down. Um, was that part of the game plan? Did Coach Q talk to you about that? Like, how did you pick those moments? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Coach Q was on the sideline um, telling me either, either to push the ball in transition or slow it down. I um, also had to conserve a little more energy uh, playing 40 minutes and having the ball. And um, I just picked moments when I saw that my teammates were open um, running in transition. And I knew if we can score in transition, it would be a little easier than having to run a set in the half court. The last question we have for Kiki today is from Patrick Gunn. Hey, Kiara, a great win today. Uh, this is probably a little bit unusual. We're playing with so many bigs in the lineup at once. Uh, what was it like playing with uh, Emily and Digna and uh, Amaya and Ma Maeva together? Uh, it was a little different, especially for Digna. She's playing at the top of the zone with me, um, something that hasn't happened all season. But, I mean, they they were able to fill, uh, fill the roles and step up and be put into any position and have success with it. Uh, I thought Emily played a great game. Um, Coach Q said she had 15 rebounds. I didn't know that. That shocked me. But I mean, that's what Emily do. That's that's why she got six men of the year. <laughs> All right. Thank you very much.